The term metal roofing refers to a vast range of roofing solutions, goods, and selections. When someone mentions metal roofing, they can be referring to standing seam roofing, metal shingles or tiles, an exposed fastening system typical of agricultural buildings, or any number of other things. Standing seam metal roofing is one of the types of metal roofing that is growing in popularity as more and more property owners seek out items that are durable, stylish, and protective of their buildings. How well do you know about standing seam metal roofing, though? Standing seam metal roofing. Standing seam metal roofing is a type of metal panel system with hidden fasteners that has vertical legs and a big, flat region in between them. Moreover, it is said to have vertical legs or elevated seams that protrude above the panel's smooth surface. Metal roofs and metal walls both benefit from standing seam systems. Whether the panel is directly affixed to the decking material beneath the vertical leg or is linked to the roof deck using a clip, the essential concept of standing seam systems is that the fastener is hidden. <laughs> Types of standing seam panel profiles the diversity of choices and alternatives available to clients is one of standing seam metal roofing's key selling factors. These options go well beyond only the color of the panel and also encompass its length, breadth, profile, shape, thickness, etc. Panel profile type is one of these options. When two or more panels are seamed together, the shape and method is referred to as a panel profile. What profile you should choose with the aid of an architect or contractor will depend on the sort of roof you have, how steep it is, what environment your property is in, and several other criteria. The standing scene category includes a variety of panel profiles, such as snap lock, mechanical seam, batten panel, and nail or fastener flange. <laughs> profiles with snap lock. Snap lock profiles are made of precision roll formed panels with male and female legs that snap together without the need for manual or mechanical seaming during installation. Using a clip that fastens to the seam and the seam behind the panel, snap lock profiles are fastened to the roof deck. Panels with fastener flanges employ a similar locking mechanism, but since true snap locks permit the system to float freely with their clip system, we do not classify fastener flange as a snap lock. Mechanical lock profiles. Also roll formed with precise edges that line up with one another are mechanically seamed panels. A hand or motorized seamer bends the edges and secures the panels together after the two panels are engaged. Mechanical seams come in two varieties, single lock 90 degree seams and double lock 180 degree seams. <laughs> Batten panel profiles. When two panel legs are roll formed and stacked next to one another, the roofing system is known as a batten panel roofing system. The legs are then sewn together by a metal cover that either snaps on or is manually sewn into place. There are two widely used styles for the portion that covers the legs, T-seams and snap caps. <laughs> Quick facts about T-seams. T-seams are manually sewn into place, so they will hold up well in adverse weather conditions. T-seams typically have pre-installed sealant in the cap itself and are more weathertight than snap cap batten panels. Works effectively in scenarios involving both steep and flat slopes. The field is a relatively simple area to replace or fix individual T-seam panels. <laughs> snap cap quick information. Snap caps, as the name implies, are applied over the panel legs without using any mechanical seaming. Applications involving curved panels frequently use snap caps. Correct installation is necessary for snap cap panel systems to function properly. The top batten piece frequently slides off or down the seam, especially when it is done incorrectly. To give the seam a more solid architectural appearance, certain snap cap systems will make use of an existing mechanical lock or snap lock mechanism. Instead of being functional, these systems are mainly for aesthetics. Fastener or nail flange profiles. Similar to a snap lock panel system, a nail flange fastens the panel to the roof deck directly through the male leg of the metal panel rather than utilizing a clip. When the fasteners are secured, the panel's female leg simply snaps over the whole length of the male leg to conceal the fastening head. <laughs> sizes, options, and more for standing seam panels. There are many sizes that panels can be bought at or roll formed to on site in addition to a variety of profiles. Typically, performance requirements, how well it fits the profile, and customer preferences determine the suggested size. 
panel widths. Although panel widths can vary depending on the manufacturer, the majority of standing seam metal roof panels have a width of between 12 and 18 inches, with 16 inches being the most typical. Standing seam panels are not as wide as their counterparts at big box stores like Home Depot or Lowe's since doing so would affect the performance, as opposed to lap seam or other exposed fastener panels. Some roll forming machines have an adjustment that allows them to roll panels wider than 18 inches, but check with your manufacturer or installer to be sure the engineering is still up to date, if applicable. Heights of seam. The heights of the standing seam section of the panel system, also known as the rib height, are just as important as panel widths. The majority of standing seam systems permit seams between 1 inch and 3 inches. However, the most popular options tend to be 2 inch and 112 inches. The most architecturally specified panel for snap lock systems, particularly for commercial applications, has 134 inches of seams. Rib rollers, stiffening ribs or striations. Striations are the patterns roll formed between the seams of a metal roofing panel. They can be used to help with the installation of a metal roof, to help hide oil canning, or simply for aesthetic purposes. In reality, we advise employing striations in standing seam panels, with some possibilities being flat. There are no dents in the seams. Striated. The panel is indented with a few regular lines. Forms or indentations between seams are referred to as ribs. Panel indents in the shape of AV. Longer, rectangular panel indents are known as beads. A stiffening rib next to the seam that creates room for a clip underneath is called a clip relief. Thicknesses. There are numerous thicknesses of the metal coil used to roll form panels. Standing seam panels, on the other hand, are normally between 22 and 26 gauges with 24 gauge galvalum being the most popular thickness. The thickness of aluminum standing seam panels ranges from 0 0.032 to 0 0.040 inches. Standing seam metal roofing's benefits. No exposed fasteners should be used. Standing seam metal roofing has a number of major advantages, including the absence of visible fasteners on the surface, which protects them from UV rays, moisture, wind, and other elements that can wear or weaken a fastener over time. Moreover, standing seam solutions prevent holes from being made in the panels that shield your structure. Standing seam systems are frequently used to conceal fastener heads since some people find them to be ugly. Option for engineered systems tested to perform to high standards. Standing seam metal roofing systems from reputable manufacturers have passed rigorous industry testing, making them eligible to be categorized as design systems with a track record of success in adverse weather conditions. In places vulnerable to hurricanes and strong winds, having this engineered option is essential. Enables thermal movement. Limiting the expansion and contraction necessary for a metal panel's correct thermal movement can lead to issues like oil canning fastener pullout, increased noise, and other problems. The panels of standing seam metal roofing systems are typically not pinned, allowing for easier expansion and contraction. This is especially true if expansion or slider clips have been placed, or if the system is a snap lock system, which allows for free movement with a clip. Lifespan and longevity. When compared to other roofing materials like shingles or tiles, metal is already a durable and low maintenance roofing option. With standing seam systems, regular maintenance to check for loosened or damaged fasteners is less frequent because the fastener doesn't go through the surface of the metal. A standing seam roof must still be maintained, albeit it will probably need to be done by a qualified maintenance contractor. Warranties The guarantees that manufacturers provide, particularly the weathertight warranties that guarantee their systems won't malfunction, are further safety for standing seam systems. Furthermore, the manufacturer is in charge of performing the necessary repairs if it does malfunction. Remember that only commercial installations are often eligible for weather-type warranties. Modern, constant, and sleek appearance. Because of its contemporary and sleek appearance, standing seam is becoming more and more common in architectural applications. The metal in these panel systems can be practically any color, including bespoke hues, to fit your building in addition to the sleek, straight lines they give. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comment section below.
If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.